Welcome Wolf and Wolfettes! We are back with Fat Princess Adventures on the PS4 and right now our evil little genius over here is still heading to the Black Forest because we need to rescue or find out what has happened to Princess Muffin Top. We have rescued Princess Plump but it seems like Princess Muffin Top is still in danger. So that's what we're doing at the moment. Now I think if you guys are not a fan of spiders then I think this episode may contain a couple of cartoon spiders because I know there are a few people that are uh, <laughs> a few people that are very extreme with their arachnophobia I mean like really extreme I mean I I'm not a fan of spiders Wolf Wolf I fucking hate spiders especially tarantulas but when I play things like Skyrim and all these other games with spiders in I don't really care but there are some bloody people that they, they take fear to a whole new level <laughs> so uh, it's just a warning for you guys I don't want you to shit yourself while watching my video now, um, as you can see, there's a, oh shit, oh god, hash, and mango, oh my god, an ampersand, <laughs> oi, oh fucking hell, That's bloody, I've just turned the video on, you can't send bosses at me that quick, it's like the three musketeers over here, ain't it, he's got a flaming sword, looks like he's been playing too much Dark Souls, oh, I think we might already have this bandana, yes, oh, we only got 100 gold, Oh shit, we turned into Chunky Lappy again. Uh, can I actually break these as fatty? No. Now, I think to break these, as we saw last episode, I think you need bombs to break these open. So I'm not I'm not 100% sure, but I guess it is bombs. I guess maybe the engineer can do it then. So if you bring an engineer, I guess he could open these chests up for you. Right, now which way are we heading? I had to actually do a bit of this level before I started recording because uh, it didn't give me a checkpoint. It sent me quite far back. Ah. Now, actually, uh, that's a point. We needed to we needed to find that dude's arrow. He said he shot it over the wall, so I, I expected it to be in this vicinity here. But it looks like it may actually be up here, because I don't know what that little bit of paper symbol is. It must be a quest. Let's have a look. Maybe we finally found his um. Oh God, found his arrow. <laughs> if we have, if we have found his arrow, though, I'm not going to bother taking it back. I'm not going to travel all the way back to the city just to give him his bloody love arrow back. <laughs> That's way too far. Oh! I really hate these dudes. I was watching the trailer uh, for this because I haven't actually seen the launch trailer yet. And there is quite a few fancy bosses in this game that we haven't seen yet. They look like they're going to be a lot more tough than the one we uh, had to fight a few days ago. But what I'm thinking of doing is... I'm not sure. I think this may actually have the... Uh, like couch co-op. I swear it said in the description it's got couch co-op and if it has I might get my sister involved and she'll probably play as a warrior or something which would be pretty good because I think Muhammad asked for uh, me to play as a warrior so if she could be the warrior then I can kill two birds with one stone can't I? <laughs> I can make the game easier for myself and I can also oh, what's that? Tactical blast vest bloody hell I get the feeling we should play as an engineer I'm not sure where all the mage gear is. I mean, when I played this in the beta, I actually uh, I found a onesie for uh, my mage. And it was pretty decent, actually. And I've not really found it again. And I found it right near the beginning. Ah, oh! <laughs> I love how they leave their eyeballs behind. Oh, look. Arrows. Oh! Oh, yeah. It must be where he's... Yeah, look. This is definitely where he shot his arrow. How the flipping hell did he shoot his arrow this far? I like how he's randomly killed a bunch of goblins. Ha! <laughs> Ah, oh, passing notes. Of course, uh, I'm not gonna. Yeah, I'm not gonna bother taking this back. I suppose we're gonna go back to the city eventually, anyway. So we'll just give it to him then. Right, let's have a look down here for any chests, and then we'll head off to the Black Forest. Oh no, fucking hell! I need a bomb again. Oh now, nah. I think these ones you can actually burn. So if I switch my staff, because I might have a fire staff. Oh shit, I'm fat. <laughs> you uh, can't change your gear when you're fat for some reason. I'm not sure why. Are you, you actually, he looks a little bit like Santa Claus. If we get him a Christmas hat, like a Santa hat, he'd be sorted, mate. This could be a Christmas video. Right, um, let's have a look. We've got an, there we go, arson blaze. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah, okay. So you definitely do need different characters to open these chests. So that's definitely going to be an engineer, ain't it? Let's switch my staff back. I would prefer to use the fire one, but this one's more powerful. And it has a bird house on top of it which is a reason for me to not change it 
I just shot a chicken by mistake. I do apologise. Oh, shit. I'm going to bring this chicken with me because it looks absolutely adorable. Come on, chicken. Off we go. Travelling to Black Forest. Oh, lovely. Oh. While the level is loading, would you mind fetching a lint-free rag? There's cat hair all over the screen again. Oh. <laughs> there probably is cat hair over my screen, actually, because my uh, cat Ivy, if you've seen my uh, pets video, she really likes sleep sitting behind my tally. I think it's because of the warmth. Evil lurks in the heart of the Black Forest. Prepare for the worst by buying a new outfit. Um, I didn't actually know you could buy her uh, gear. No, you can upgrade, but it doesn't say anything about uh, getting new gear. I'm going to upgrade my weapon again. I don't see the point in upgrade. Hang on a minute. Oh. <laughs> you could turn this uh, staff into a balloon animal if you're bored. <laughs> right, we're going to upgrade our staff again. It's probably not for the best, but never mind. Oops. Come back soon. Oh, finally. Some more defenders of the cake. It's wonderful to see you here in the Black Forest. I think I know why y'all are here. We are searching for Princess Muffin Top. Yep, we saw the goblins carrying her in a cage. They headed north toward the new gate they just finished building. They aren't gonna open that gate for just anyone, though. You'll have to look like a goblin. I suggest killing a few goblins to see if you can get hold of their helmets. There's bound to be plenty still roaming around the forest. Okay, point me toward adventure. Evil adventure. Just across this here bridge. I would check that way, but stay here as long as you like. Welcome. Welcome to what's left of Titania. Good luck. Cool, you don't have to make this game sound so depressing. What's wrong with you two? <laughs> anyway, uh, so what we've got to do, by the looks of it, is we're going to need to find uh, a disguise so we can enter into some orc stronghold where they're going to be holding the um, Princess Muffin Top. Okay, well, y'all take care of yourself now, you hear? Good. <laughs> oh, they're voices. Oh. Oh, no, I don't want to pick up the chicken, no. Can I speak to you? No, she doesn't want to speak to me. I guess she doesn't like me because I'm an evil genius. Oh, dear. I guess they're like the people of Skyrim that really hate magic. Oh, fucking hell. Really sneaky, isn't they, these goblins? Now, when you think of goblins, you think of, like, snarly, noisy beasts. But in this game, they're fucking... They're really... Ow! I'm getting critted! Flipping out the damage! Jesus! God, there is, um... It sounds like the kids next to my house are going absolutely... Because it's Christmas now, the kids in the school next to my house seem to be just, like, playing in the playground literally 24 fucking 7 so if you can hear screaming and shouting in my videos for the next probably two weeks maybe maybe even longer than that then uh, that's why because if, apparently it's fun to do pe in your shorts and t-shirt in minus one weather because that's that's apparently what they love doing every day at the moment and ruining every single one of my videos <laughs> i have a limited time every day for new people where i can record i've got about an hour a day where i can record one or three videos, depending on how well I do and if there's any delays. And um, lately, even that one select hour that I've got to record, the kids have been outside being absolute little bastards making noise. So, uh, yeah, it's not been fun making videos lately. Shit, they poisoned me. Now, this is the spider section, as you can see. <laughs> so, if you're not a fan, I guess you get off the video right now. They do look a bit cute, though, don't they? Oh, shit, they can jump. Oh, God. Don't know if you guys have seen a film if called Eight Legged Freaks, but holy shit, it's a comedy. It's like it's like a horror comedy movie kind of thing where the world is overrun by spiders and they all get like massively big. And I tell you, it's hilarious. How, some of the noises the spiders make is fucking is hilarious though. And one of the spiders even punches somebody in the film. So uh, that's the kind of film you're going to be dealing with if you do watch it. <laughs> it's it's great. It's quite an old film. Come out in the 2000s, I think. Oh shit! Quick. Now, was there a, um... Get away from me, spider! Was there a chest back here that had stone on it? Please! Just leave me alone! <laughs> I, just, I just want loot. 
I swear, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill those kids. Even though that sounds very evil, it's gotta happen. <laughs> it's gotta fucking happen. Oh dear, those bloody kids. Oh, I'll tell you, when I have kids in the future, I'm, they're never gonna be shouting like that. I mean, I don't like kids having fun and that, because kids are kids, but fucking hell, when they shout like that, I tell you. It gets right on my gears. Right, so it looks like that's where we got to head to the, uh, yeah. Looks like that's where the goblin stronghold is. So, do we go this way or should we go through the farm? I suppose we should go this way. It's probably a bunch of, like, treasure chests and stuff. Now, this stuff here, this vo these vines, they're bloody annoying because some of them shoot random spikes of poison at you. And if you get hit, you get poisoned. So, uh, be careful in this area. I'm not sure if they all do it or if you get close. I'm not sure. There's a lot of oh shit spider eggs. Fucking spiders, leave me alone! <laughs> I don't want to play. Oh god! What I need is a nice piece of delicious cake. I assume the spiders won't be holding cake, will they? Oh. Hello there. Yeah, I'm gonna need a little more time to get this bridge done. Ah uh, yeah, we were gonna have a viewing platform, a gift shop, even an advanced safety railing system. Alas, we trimmed the plan down to just this boardwalk. I'm just saying, if you could, a donation will really help kickstart this thing. Anyway, come back real soon, okay? <laughs> I've got to be honest with you, bridge repair specialist. It sounds like you are building South End Pier. If any of you guys don't know, that's in England and it's the largest pier in the world, South End Pier. It's been, it's been halved in recent years because I think so far since South End Pier has been built, it's been set on fire twice where it's like half of it's burnt down. And I think twice a boat has, has gone through it. So, uh, yeah, I think it used to be three miles long. Now it's only about... I think it's about a mile and a half now. Maybe a bit less than that, but I think it's still the biggest in the world. But exactly what sounds exactly like what she's building. Because there's gift shops and, like, a, a restaurant, a, uh, a train service that takes you to the end of it if you're too fat to walk. All that good stuff. Now, these goblins right here, these goblin champions, I think these are the ones we have to kill to get the helmet so we can be disguised. Because uh, every single character needs to get one. Now, did I? Oh, I don't think I've got a helmet. Does it drop or does it automatically go in your inventory? No, we did. I don't think we got one. No, we didn't. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so we need to kill a mage to find a mage helmet. I suppose that's the perks of playing this on my own. I ain't going to have to worry about getting everybody a different hat. <laughs> Fucking hell, he took a big bit of damage then, didn't he? You see that? Bloody hell. I didn't want to attack the uh, goblin gladiator, but thanks a lot, evil genius. That's real helpful. Oh, there we go. They started to shoot their bloody poison now. Careful. Careful. Oh. I really hate these ones. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> so I've gone fat mode. Come on, get in there. Go on, knock them all out. Oh, shit. Come on, quick, before you... Oh, no, I've gone short again. Get back. Get back. Oh, no. Please don't die. Oh, there we go. Champion. Hopefully he drops a hat. No, I don't think he dropped a hat again. And I just got attacked by some weird crystal looking spider by the looks of it. That was weird. <laughs> what the hell was that? I killed it, whatever it was, but fucking hell. Ah, come on. Get back. Come on, leave me alone. Shit, fucking hell. They don't die, do they? Oh, no, I'm dead. Oh, there we go. Oh, a nice piece of cake. Oh, okay. So we've got a goblin skull cap. Oh shit, I put no! No! Oh fuck! Stupid poison! <laughs> ah! Are they all, they're all gonna be alive again, aren't they? Oh shit, this ain't the right way, is it? I think they're all gonna be alive, I guess. I don't know, which way did we go? I think we might be going the wrong way. Leave me alone, spiders. It was this way, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh no, I don't think they're back to life. That's alright. 
Looks... Yeah, that's okay then. So it makes it a bit more easy. <laughs> Not that it wasn't easy anyway. Uh, there's a bunch of... Um... What the hell is that? Oh, God! Shit! Oh, fuck! Run away! Run away! Run away! Quick! Hurry up, for God's sake! Turn into a flipping human! Turn into a human! Come on! Right, let's uh, have a look. Can I wear... No, we do have to find a mage hat. So, uh, yeah, this is going to take a while, I guess. <laughs> oh, hopefully one of these has one. Oh, what's that? Oh! Oh, that's not good! Oh, <laughs> Oh! Very nice. Clay's delicious. Um, I'm going to change my weapon back. Gotta tell you, this uh, Christmas hat that I'm wearing, the ball ball on it, is very bloody annoying. God, we are finding a lot of chests, ain't we? Very nice. Oh, more warrior gear. Thank you. I'm so glad you gave me more warrior gear, because I didn't have enough of that already. <laughs> I don't know if there's like a... a um, if you can, like, add any of your weapons to a quick bar or anything. Oh, a lightning, uh, bomb. So switch back to our... Oh, no. I pissed off a chicken again. <laughs> You'd think with Christmas coming that all these chicken things would, uh, you know, like, behave and try and be on humans' good side because they don't want to be turned into Christmas dinner. I know you eat turkey for Christmas dinner, but some people seem to eat chicken. I guess people that don't like turkey. <laughs> so, uh, you'd think that the animals want to actually be nice to you during this time, so you don't actually eat them. But nope, not in this game. They're all pissed. They want to be turned into Christmas dinner. Ah, fucking vines. There is a, a distinct lack of cake in this land, and it's really annoying. Especially when you're playing on your own. I should have probably picked the warrior class. Hurry, eat something, or you could die. Really, narrator? I would eat something if you gave me some more cake. Oh no, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh for fuck's sake! I'm not making no progress. I'm not a duh. Oh, what are you two doing? I hope they have a, I hope they ain't gonna respawn after a certain amount of time. That's not good. Let's have a look. Where we got to go? Yeah, let's head up towards that checkpoint so we can actually, uh, you know, make some progress. And if we die, not get sent back 200 miles. Told you these vines were very annoying. <laughs> yeah, come on, spiders. Come over here. Yeah, come on. I've got some presents for you. Hopefully none of this shoots poison. Oh no, there, there's one. Watch out. Watch out. Be careful, Beowulf. Oh, checkpoint reached. Finally. I need to use my awesome power more often. I keep forgetting I've got it. Right, we'll get through this bit and I'm going to have to end it for today. Sorry about today's video. It seems like I've just been moaning most of this video. <laughs> Getting angry at the stupid kids near my house and, you know, dying a lot. Oh, dear. Oh! Oh, what the hell is that? I just murdered a bear! I didn't know there was bears. I don't think I got this far, actually. <laughs> I didn't know there was bears. Oh, no, I'm fat again. I didn't even... How come the bears got cake? They must be Yogi Bear, then. Probably robbing people's picnic baskets. <laughs> Oh dear, well I'm going to end it now, Wolf and Wolfettes. Thanks for watching, Wolf and Wolfettes. Next episode, I guess we're going to have to try and find a uh, mage hat from one of the goblins so we can disguise ourselves, so we can get into their fortress and rescue Princess Muffin Top. Like, share, and join the pack today. Oh!